Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing really, really well. In today's video, I have a perfume review video from Prada. This is, I think, a second one Prada perfume review video I've done because I feel like I've done the Prada Luna Rosa Ocean. This is the female version from Prada fragrances. Now, well, my channel is genderless, so it's more like a female inspired or more marketed for the female that's uh, out there. You guys, this is the first fragrance that since L'Oreal took over the brand, this is the first launch that they have created within the brand. And I got the bottle in here, NPR. This is the Prada Paradox, you guys. This is such a beautiful, beautiful, unique, unique fragrance. When I saw this, I was like, oh my god, this is so Prada and they didn't or they haven't got it any better. I'm gonna get into all the details in a second, but yeah, just let us just appreciate the bottle and the unique kind of shape of it. It's got the iconic Prada triangle and I love it. I absolutely love it. This is not a first impression. I've already smelled this fragrance. Got the box in here and also got the sample size just in here as well. Look how beautiful the sample size are. They're not like this. It's like this, similar like the box, so they literally look the same, but in a sample size. Now, Prada Beauty is proud to present a new feminine fragrance with the launch of Paradox Eau de Parfum. A new scent which perfectly embodies the codes and values of the iconic Italian fashion powerhouse. For women, impossible to frame, an invitation to explore and express the multiple dimensions of your identity. A, ce a celebration of being never the same, always yourself so this is kind of the campaign of it and the name paradox what is inspired of a powerful name for a powerful fragrance paradox explores the unexpected regulations of constructions to celebrate a woman's multi-dimensional self-expressions a unique fragrance which explores the different facets of a woman's personality so it should basically empower you and uh, kind of be different never the same but always be yourself so this is the kind of message of this fragrance but being woman very like empowered and kind of strong confident and stuff like that so this is the whole kind of message of this brand or of the fragrance in general and hence why they've created this fragrance which is called paradox now, I'm sure you guys are also very excited to try the fragrance, so I'm going to put the fragrance in here, get the sample size in here, and let me just spray the fragrance on my skin because I'm really, really excited to try it with you guys together. I've already smelled it just once, so I'm excited to try it for the second time because, you guys, I remember the first moment when I smelled it, I was really, really presently, presently surprised. Wow. Oh my god. It's just so delicious and it's just, it's very nice and sweet. Got a bit of kind of hint of citrus. As well as being very girly, very feminine and very just like empowering. I feel like I'm very put together, very like I'm ready for the day. I know what I'm doing and I feel myself basically. Mm. Such a beautiful, beautiful blend of fragrances. Let me just get into the notes of this because I'm pretty sure you guys are also very excited to see the notes of this fragrance. So for the creation of this Eau de Parfum, the perfumers wanted to create a floral addiction, which embodies the values and codes of the Prada house. A timeless floral bouquet, reinventing classic and traditional raw materials and accords to reveal the most appealing facets in a modern, avant-garde and sophisticated Way. By the way, I'm reading from the press kind of notes in here, so sorry if I'm looking down. Um, so, reinvent freshness. The top notes and contains neroli bud. The scent of the neroli bud is captured before it opens to obtain the freshest, most radiant and captivating facets of the iconic green floral. Then in the middle notes, it contains amber. Reinvent intensity. The perfumers reinvented the iconic and often masculine accord of amber to bring a new intensity and sophisticated to this signature scent. And lastly, in the base note, it contains a note which I'm not that familiar about, so sorry if I pronounce it correct, incorrectly. Serenolite. Seren, serenolite? Serenolite. Serenolite. There we go. 
reinvent sensuality. Using new technology, the perfumers perfected serenolite, the lightest musk molecule and never before used, ensuring sensuality from the initial impression, which perfectly glides to the fragrance composition. So overall, if I look into the notes, it's got, as they said, it's got like a floral addiction. This is the main kind of purpose of it. It's got three main notes of it. So the neroli bud, amber, and let's just say the musk. Neroli bud, they've used it because of the iconic green color from Prada. I'm sure you guys know that Prada uses green in all of the boutiques. So they've used this kind of green note to kind of symbolize the fragrance with the fashion together with the fragrances. So the neroli bud is the most kind of strongest bud and with the most kind of freshest one out there. So I know what they mean. And then amber, which has got the same kind of note as the vanillary, tonkabini, but more an essential, more intense way, which is so beautiful. Mm, I can smell the amber as well. It makes this fragrance very nice and sweet. And lastly, to make the fragrance long lasting onto the skin, they have used musk. Musk contains a more like a powdery, more like a sensuality, more like a fresh, comforting scent that's very long lasting and leaves a nice trail onto the skin. Mm. It's very creamy as well at the same time, like the amber and the musk makes this fragrance very nice and creamy. It's just a very nice opening freshness to it because of the neroli but so yeah i'm gonna let the fragrance sink in in a little bit i'm gonna get into some other stuff with you guys the bottle where is it oh my god i'm so love in love and over the bottle the iconic prada triangle prada has reinvented the iconic triangle logo to create the new paradox bottle a bottle crafted of contrast and paradoxes reflecting the different facets of prada woman sophistication with the white gold letters on an intense black cap contrasting with the delicate coral blue uh, hue. Now it's got the Prada logo in here and the coral color juice. Avant-garde. Minimalist, luxurious design. Very minimal packaging and very luxurious and heavy to hold with. Touch of eccentricity. Titled, position yet always grounded. A piece of art, the bottle is a masterpiece. The bottle feels like Prada, which is so, so true. The bottle does feel like Prada and I love it so, so much. Like, look at the beautiful, beautiful bottle. Now, the bottle is beautifully made. The reason why it's beautifully made because it's a refillable bottle. This is the first ever refillable bottle fragrance from Prada House. So, when you finish this fragrance, please, please do not throw the bottle away. Keep it because they're all refillable, which is such a nice thing for the environment. So, the refillable bottle is committed to a more sustainable future. For the launch of Paradox, the brand introduced the first refillable in the fragrance collection. Designed to last, every size of Paradox can be refilled using the Eco Refill Bottle. So, the, they sell the refill um, Eco Refill Bottle, which is a 100 ml bottle and it will literally last you for a long time. Now, let's speaking of the size and the prices of this fragrance. So, the smaller size comes in a 30 ml and it retails for £59. This is a 50 ml and this retails for £83. And the bigger size is a 90 ml and this retails for £118. And the refill bottle, as I said, is 100 ml. The price of it, I'm honestly not sure. Also, the prices that I've just mentioned. It just depends on the retailer and depends where you are. So the prices might vary the cost of your location and of the retailer. So bear that in mind. This is a 50 ml bottle and it's an Eda Parfum. In terms of the price point, it is more on the expensive side, I would say. Of course, it's the Eda Parfum and of course, women's fragrances are more expensive than men's fragrances. So I would say similar kind of price points of the other Prada fragrances, but it's a little bit more up there in price. So it's a new launch, it's a new fragrance and it's a huge, huge investment. So better than mine, hence why the price point is a bit more up there. Let me quickly mention the media and the face of this fragrance. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen the face already. It is Emma Watson. Such an amazing surprise to see her. The Paradox Woman is immediately recognizable yet impossible to define. 
proud that I am proud to present Emma Watson as the face of the new Edipa fam. Highly regarded, world famous actress and outspoken feminist and activist with a passion of sustainability in creating a better world. An icon perfectly expressing a multi dimensional woman and reflecting the brand values and codes of the Prada house. The campaign paradox is exploring the different facets of multi dimensional woman in a powerful advertising, visual, and film. A captivating, inspiring campaign which was written, directing, and produced and stars all by herself, Emma Watson. She is the director of the own campaign. Basically, it's a huge, huge deal because she is the one that um, kind of created the campaign and kind of made the film of the fragrance, which is so unique and so different. And she's also the face of this fragrance. So it's a very, very nice touch to see. She's a very nice, beautiful actress feminist, activist, and she's always fighting for a better world in the future. So who else would be more suitable rather than Emma Watson? So this is a very nice thing to see. I'm gonna insert some pictures on the screen and picture you guys have seen all over on social media. And um, yeah, you guys, so this was the fragrance. Now the freshness has gone a little bit and now it has dried down to this kind of warmed, sweet, kind of ambery and white musky scent honestly it's a very beautiful fragrance nothing i've ever smelled before very different very unique and very proud of if i see all the campaign all the bottle and stuff like that it really really symbolizes this kind of scent so it's a very very beautiful scent it's more like a floral based fragrance like a floral addiction so better than mine however if you like a fragrance like this this could be someone for anyone so this could be something for everyone that you can wear and wear every day. It's good for everyday wear and even for nights out it's also a nice fragrance because it's a very strong Eau Parfum fragrance. And uh, would I recommend you guys to check this fragrance out 100%. It's such a beautiful fragrance. Definitely keep an eye on social media because there will be loads of sampling. So check out the Prada website and the social media and the Prada Beauty Instagram because there will do loads of sampling. So better than mine definitely get yourself a sample and this fragrance is already out and launched in the market. If you're passing by a Prada counter, definitely stop by and smell it. It's also available in the Prada boutiques. So if you're looking in the handbag section and stuff like that, you will also find the Paradox fragrance over there as well. And on this note, I'm gonna end this video in here. So I hope I covered literally everything about this fragrance. I feel like this fragrance is so beautiful and I'm gonna definitely give this to my sister because I'm pretty sure she will love this fragrance. So I hope you guys liked this video and enjoyed it. So if you didn't, please give this video a like and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more perfume review videos like these. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, I will see you guys in my next video.